You have nails for breakfast. What's the matter? Why are you so honored? You miss me, huh? Oh, oh yes, sir. I, I miss you like a like a hog miss fly, <laughs> like a like a, a baby miss mammy titty. <laughs> I miss you like I misses a rock in my shoe. <laughs> now I ask you, who this nigga on that nag? It's Snowball. You wanna know my name or the name of my horse? You ask me. That's who the hell you calling Snowball, horse boy? I'll snatch your black ass off that nag down here in the mud so fast, make your head. Steven, 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 Steven. Let's keep it funny. Django here is a freeman. This nigga here? That nigga there. Let me at least introduce the two of you. Django, this is another cheeky black bugger like yourself, Steven. Steven, this here is Django. You two ought to hate each other. Calvin, just who the hell is this nigga you feels the need to entertain? Django and his friend in gray here, Dr. Schultz, are customers. And they are our guests, Stephen. And you, you old decrepit bastard, ought to show them every hospitality. You understand that? Yes, sir. Him, I understand, but I don't know why I got to take lip well, off this you nigga. You don't have to know why. Do you understand? Yes, sir. I, I understand. Well, good. Let's spend a night. Go up in the guest bedroom to get too ready. He's gonna stay in the big house? Steven, he's a slaver. It's different. In the big house? Well, you got a problem with that? Oh, no, no, I ain't got no problem with it. If you ain't got no problem with burning the bed, the sheets, the pillowcases, and everything else when this black ass motherfucker's gone. Now, that gone. is my problem. They are mine to burn. Now, your problem right now is making a good impression. And I want you to start solving that problem right now and get them goddamn rooms ready. Yes, sir, Mr. Kennedy. Go on now. I can't believe you brought a nigga to stay in the big house. Your daddy rolling over in this goddamn grave right now. Yeah. Nigga in the it's getting house. worse and worse. What shit is that? Now, where is my beautiful sister? There she is! Woo! Dr. Schultz, this attractive Southern Belle is my widowed sister. Darling, you are a tonic for tired eyes. Oh, I don't know about the nigga girl you were talking about. Nigga gal. Yeah, I believe you mentioned she spoke German. Ah, yes, Hildy, what about him? Uh, do, do you think before the demonstration you could send her around to my room? <laughs> you little dickens, you. <laughs> I don't see why not. Stephen, when you get through showing them to their rooms, go fetch Hilda, get her cleaned up and smell them real nice and sent over to Dr. Schultz. <laughs> Actually, Mitchell Candy, it's, a, mm. it's a, something I ain't, I ain't told you about yet. What? Uh, Hilda in the hot bar. What's she doing there? What you think she doing there in the hot box? She been punished. What's she do? She run off again. Jesus Christ, Stephen, how many people ran away while I was gone? Two. When did she go? Last night. They, they brung her back this morning. How bad did some tough as dogs tear her up? Lucky for her, they was out chasing D'Artagnan's ass. Now, Bill and Cody went looking for her, found her, brung her back. Uh, uh, now, she a little beat up, mm. but but she done that to all damn self, running through them damn bushes and shit. How long she been in the box? How long you think she been in there all damn day? Mm. And the little bitch got ten more days to be in there. Still, take her out. Take her out? Why? Because I said so, that's why. Dr. Schultz is my guest. Hildy is my nigga. Southern hospitality dictates I make her available to him. But, Miss Candy, she run off. Steve, what is the point of having a nigga that speaks German if you can't wheel him out when you have a German guest? Now, I realize it is inconvenient, but still, you take her ass out. Yes, sir. Lolly, will you and Cole be responsible for getting Hilda cleaned up and presentable for Dr. Schultz here? Of course, Dr. Now, gentlemen, I do apologize, but I am weary from our travels beyond words. It is time for me to rest my tired eyes. The man, get your ass up out of there. Go. Hurry up. Get over there, get her cleaned up, bring her back over here to the doctor. What, what, what do you say your name is? You?
Coming with me is you gonna sleep in that little box over here. I said to Miss Lord. Goodbye. Bye, Miss Lord. I count six shots. I count two guns, nigga. There you go! 